Hi guys, welcome back to Minecraft. This might seem a little strange. Why is this a chest? That's, oh, I guess it is a chest. Okay, whatever. Uh, this might seem a little strange. Why am I here? Why am I outside my other base? Well, in the last episode, I found this village and spent the rest of the time looking for a horse. And while that might seem like a fun episode to do for 15 minutes, I didn't find the horse. So, we're gonna just say that episode didn't happen. And, fun thing, I have somehow built two chests. Whatever, okay. I have some obsidian, I only need five more obsidian. I have the diamonds to get the obsidian. I have two things of lava right here. What I should do is start making some buckets. I know there's like a lava vat around here, so I'm gonna start looking for that. And we're gonna see where we go from there. Let's see, I only need three buckets. Probably don't need a whole lot of that. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's see, let's get rid of the saddle at the moment. If we find actually, you know what? I know I know horses spawn on Savannah, so I might as well keep that. Get rid of the leather, get rid of the stairs, get rid of this. Let's just keep the rest. Ooh, I have three strings, so I can eventually build a bow. <coughs> oh, excuse me, I had some of my throat. Let's see, what uh, I need to make a bucket. Let's make two. And eventually I can make my gate. Okay. I swear the uh, lava was over here this way. I think it was down here and back there. Alright, let's go. These trees are so weird. They're like at weird angles. I'm gonna take one with me because I'm a little bit low on wood at the moment. Because it's weird wood. Orange. Orange planks. Okay. Let's take it all and run this way. There are some pigs. Not very useful to me at the moment. But I'm pretty sure there's lava somewhere around here. What we're going to be looking for is random fire. Nope. Not here. So if we do find lava, it's going to make our job a lot easier to make that gate. Okay, I see lava down there and my chunks aren't loading. I think there's lava back here on the plains. Hopefully I can find it. More cows. Mm. You can also check in deserts for lava. Usually there's at least one above ground lava thing there. There's some water. That really doesn't help us at the moment. I'll probably use the ocean for my uh, actual water. Okay, here's a cave. Nothing really interesting in there. Come on, I want to find this lava. There is a big drop there. There's some gravel. That really isn't what we're looking for, though. There's a wolf. Too bad I don't have any bones. I swear, there was lava back here somewhere. I mean, once you're near it, you'll hear it. Is this it? Yep, right here. Okay, I got two lava buckets. I'm going to have to make this trip a couple times. So right now I have four. I forgot. Oh. Let's get back to our thing. Use our ocean water. Let's kill these chickens. There's one. There's two. Don't tell me this was lava, is it? No, it's just stone. Okay. It's gonna be a long run back. <clears throat> 
Savannah. So, yeah, I spent the last episode looking for horses. I couldn't find any, but apparently they do spawn on planes. And I'm not sure exactly how the spawn mechanic works, but I'm hoping eventually some stupid horses will spawn here so I can use my saddle and tame one. Now, we all know the odds of that happening, now that I said it, are pretty much zero, but hey, we'll see if it actually happens. And here are some more mm. cows. That is a long run. So I got four... I got four source blocks. I think if it's too deep, I'll be able to make it a lot easier. Okay. So I believe how to do... Uh, how to get obsidian is the following. You dig a little hole. You take the water, and you put it over there. Yeah, okay. There's one. Let's get my other lava bucket out. Put it right next to this. There's two. If I really wanted to, I could have just taken a taken a water bucket and used my diamond pickaxe. It's probably the better way to go, the more efficient way to go. Let's make that diamond pickaxe. I I don't need sticks. I have sticks. I can even make a diamond sword. I'll have to think about it. Uh, I think I'm gonna hold off and make an enchanting table. So, let me hold on to my diamonds. I only have nine levels at the moment. I can't really make anything good. But the good thing is I have those bookshelves right there, so if I want to make... Uh, have better enchantments, it's pretty easy. So yeah, this time I'm going to do it the smart way. Just bring the water bucket with me. And then mine it normally. And we're running back and forth, running back and forth. Now I could dig down and get lava that way, but this way is a lot faster. E even with these big trips in between, I mean, normally when you when you look for lava, you have to dig way deep. And this means I'll be able to get to the Nether relatively fast. I should be able to hear it soon. I don't know why it's taken so long to spawn stupid chunks. Okay, I heard it. No, maybe not. Here's gravel. I remember passing this before. Is there someone out there? Is that another village? No, that's just a desert biome. Okay. from above right here. Let's get my obsidian. I only need five more. There's one. Actually, I actually should just get the four more for the enchanting table while I'm here. There's two. Now, of course, I could have done this I think it's a little bit quicker to use the bucket method to actually move and build a gate. This is a little bit more formal. I think the other way is kind of cheating. I don't know. It's, it's not a big deal. You can do it either way. This one's just time intensive because it still takes... It takes way too long to mine obsidian. It, it's, it's mining time should be cut in half given that you're already using like one of the best picks in the game. Now that I have enough for my gate and I see the sun going down, I'm just going to run back. No need to risk dying. Don't want to die in... Well, it's really episode 3, but for your purposes, it's episode 2. And there's a wolf. Too bad I... I tried uh, getting him in the last episode, but I only had one bone. I 
I still don't. I've, I don't know why it's taking so long for chunks to load. I'm gonna look at my video settings to see uh, why it's taking so long. Apparently, there's more lava somewhere over here too, because I just heard it. Do I have gravel? That is kind of important. I need it for my flint and steel. I'll probably put it in my box. Uh, that is a random witch. Is that a villager? Is it, what's he doing? He's just sitting out here doing random, random stuff. That's a creeper. Let's get away from the creeper. Get out of my way. Okay. Let's just go ahead and go to sleep. Are you kidding me? I really don't want to face skeletons. Let's see. I got this. I can take care of them. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh my god. Thank you you for that armor. I would have died if I didn't have the armor, I think. I don't know, that's weird. Well, now I have a big gigantic hole outside my house. So that's fun. Alright. No, no, neither of those are gravel. I have to go out and find some stupid gravel. Uh, I can go in my hole and look. I, I'm sure I can find it relatively quick. Okay, let's go for it. Oh, wait. Is that gravel? Yes, it sure is. That's all I needed. Okay. Now I have enough to build the gate. I think I'm going to just put it right here. I heard the Enderman despawn. Okay. Well, that's not good. I have to get rid of the stupid lava here. There we go. Let's put this lava away. Yeah, I probably don't actually want to put the door here now that I think about it because my crap's already here. That would be a dumb plan. So instead... Yeah, let's do that. Let's move out all this. Let's just put the gate here. And put the wood behind it. So. That way it's safe to enter and exit. It's not going to be fun when a random zombie pigman spawns, but hey. What you going to do about it? It's taken up a side of our door, but it's efficient for space and it keeps us safe without having to build a new new house. Okay, let me go ahead and take this out. Okay, I have at least two arrows. I'd like more arrows than what I have right now. I have five arrows. Uh, I have seven feathers. I have two flint. If I go and farm some of this flint, so I need five more, I can make a ton of arrows, and I can even probably enchant it if I really wanted to. Let me go ahead and take the obsidian I have. It takes so long to get this out of the stupid ground. You know, I, I'm not actually going to enchant, that takes too long. <laughs> Alright. I have the flint and steel right now. Flint. Steel.
Do I still have yeah, so full set of armor? I'm gonna go out and put some more reeds. This way we can eventually trade with that guy and get some emeralds so we can trade for other random crap. That sounds like a good plan. Alright, two more diamonds. I think it's pretty obvious what I'm going to do with that. I'm going to use my three string I have to make a bow and then we're going to go in the nether and hopefully we can farm enough stuff to... God. Okay. I know you like me bro, but I, 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 I don't like you that much. Alright. Actually, I don't need that many. Alright, let's put some of our crap away. No need to hold on to that. Probably don't need to hold on to this or this at the moment. Uh, the bread is nice. I'll hold on to that for food. Don't need the gravel. Don't need the sand. Don't need the feathers. I have 11 feathers, actually. Uh, don't plan on making a farm anytime soon. So let's take our one feather and make four more arrows, why not? We're not going to be well prepared for this, but this is the fastest way to do things. So actually nine arrows. And then... Need a little bit more sticks. Make myself a bow. third slot. Let's strike this and go to the nether. Yeah! It's already episode two and we're going to the nether. That's how we do it. That's what happens when you randomly stumble upon uh... <laughs> Well! I didn't even have to look for the nether fortress. That's convenient. Um, I only have nine torches and no coal. Let's fix that. So I won't even have to uh, do anything about that. Am I out of coal? Is that my problem? Or is there just coal in here? Yeah, that's it. Okay. I have five coal. I'm going to probably have all the torches I'm going to need in there. Let's take your sticks and your coal. Okay, I got 21 torches. That should be more than enough to find a... Uh, I don't even know the name of the stupid... The annoying things. <laughs> I hear the zombie pigmen. Is that a wither skeleton? Sure is. Guess what I'm not going to fight in hardcore mode. Three of them? Yeah, I'm definitely... Oh my god! Okay. This is a really bad place to be. Two things. I just realized. When were there skeletons in the nether? And why are they in the fortress? Because there's a blaze. That's the name of those things. They're blazes. So there are three more for him. skeletons. I'm safe on both of these sides. Let's see if we can. Yeah, killed it. Okay, now it's time to sit around until my health comes back, but I can't. Because there's a blaze right there. Let's get here and heal up. And here's the thing, what's the most efficient way to farm uh, blazes? I got my bow, I'm gonna do this. How'd that miss? How'd that one miss? Ah, uh, there's one blaze rod. That's nice. I'm eventually going to have to farm some uh, ender pearls so I can make eyes of ender so I can find the stupid fortune or the uh, stronghold. 
Yeah, I really lucked into spawning in a nether fortress. Like, that's, this has never happened to me. Like, right in the center of one. Didn't even have to look for it. Well, I can eventually start making potions. That's nice. Down to seven arrows. Still one. I have no idea where you're firing from. Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Come on, buddy. That's one way to deal with those things. What is he carrying? A stone sword? Stone sword that's like broken. Okay. Well, I got a slightly more more le or sorry, slightly less used stone sword. So right now we're sitting on one 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 blaze rod. There we go, got rid of the skeleton. Hey, it's a baby pigman! I don't know when they added that, that's awesome. draw some blazes this way. What? Okay, so optimal thing to do. In fact, I'm going to get some uh, another rack to prepare for this. Is trap. Trap the spawner and make it so I can attack it without getting damaged by them. Okay. I see a blaze. I see a blaze. Now there's a lot harder now that there's skeletons. Okay, more blazes coming my way. More blaze. Come on, skeleton. Come my way. Come on, blaze. Fire me, there we go. Keep coming my way. So it takes two two fully charged shots to kill a uh, yeah, blaze. Okay. Got it. Now I have two blaze rods, and let's get away from the skeleton. All right. We got two blaze rods and still this weird guy is sitting in here. He's looking at us. <laughs> we can trade with him eventually. Is it dark out? It sure is. Uh, let's just board this thing up because apparently the glass broke at some time. Okay, he didn't, he didn't leave. We'll give him that there for a moment. Well, I got six bones. Let's sleep right now. Let's go find that wolf and see if... Uh, we can tame it. Since I, I, I mean, I got all these bones. That'd be nice to have a wolf. I can also use the rust to grow, grow crops. So now all I have to do to get to the end is flame some en or find some uh, ender pearls. But what I should do before that is enchant my stuff, and to do that I'll need levels. Because right now I'm only sitting at 11. It's, you need I don't know. In order to do what I call a safer ender ender dragon. I need like fully, fully enchanted stuff, but I don't think that's quite an option. I, I mean, I can do it. It's just gonna be kind of boring. I will take your string. 
me see if I can find that dog. There it is. Nope, there we go. Only took two. Okay, I, I didn't want to give him the steak, but he got some steak. Alright, come on, Wolfie, you're coming with me. That way I can have some free protection from uh, mobs, I guess. Really don't care if the dog dies, because I mean, this is hardcore mode. I think I'm going to get back to my house, and then we'll end the episode there. I think I hear slimes. Alright. So in the next episode, I'm probably going to build an enchanting table. And I'll start enchanting my iron armor. That sounds like a good idea, right? Yeah, it's probably because it is. Or I could enchant my uh, diamond stuff. Either one would work. Or I could get an anvil. Who knows? That's going to take a lot of iron. Ha! Ah. Ah. Alright. So now we have the derpiest house in Minecraft that I've probably ever built. I mean, the gate is like right here. Oh well. We might be able to beat the Ender Dragon in five episodes. That'd be pretty amazing, especially after I cut one doing stupid random things. Anyways, uh, see you guys in the next episode.